Hey, do you want to know what I've been working on to keep sane throughout the pandemic? A new educational photo resource. I think that many of you will find it very, very useful. Stay with me, there's quite a bit to share. And I'll also tell you about the free educational videos that I'll be uploading throughout this month. After about eight months of living in the same place, I had to finally move from my rented little paradise house because of a miscommunication with the owner. Turned out though that thanks to the lowered prices because of the pandemic, I could rent another small house and even this small room where I can work in very quietly. It's in this hotel right next to a mountain and a little forest. If you have kids, you know that quiet becomes a bit of a rarity. So this is like an office in a perfect setting. Very happy here. So what have I created? The resource is made of two parts, light-based presets for Lightroom and photo editing training videos. Let me explain. First, the collection of light-based presets for Lightroom. The idea behind these is that the main, the key factor, which should determine how you process, how you edit your photos, is light. Different kinds of light affect how everything within the frame looks in different ways. It takes years to really develop a feel for this. Many of the other presets are just very limiting, confusing, and they don't take light into consideration. With my presets, you basically get years of my experience applied to your photos with a single click and in a very logical manner. Now, do you wanna get more out of your photos? Do you wanna go further than you can do with only the presets? Because anybody who tells you that you can apply a preset and be done with a photo, they're not telling you the complete truth. You see, various types of light present specific challenges. So there are certain adjustments you'd make to a photo shot in the fog that you wouldn't necessarily make to a photo shot in golden light at sunrise or sunset. There are countless nuances and in the training videos, I'll go into all of that stuff, all the techniques, the challenges, and I'll go into all of that in great detail. There are even exercises with raw files for you to practice on. In total, there are around four hours of video training. This is a unique and a very comprehensive package. And I've honestly not seen anything quite like it out there. What are the main goals that I set out when creating this educational resource? Well, one of them is to save you a lot of time through the presets and through the photo editing techniques that you'll learn. Over the years, I've really optimized the way that I edit photos to save time. Also, Lightroom has evolved a lot and we can now get everything done quicker than ever before. But what's the ultimate goal of a resource like this? Why do we even need to use presets or to learn photo processing? I think that most probably would agree that we want to use photo processing, photo editing to help us create photos which are evocative. Uh, photos which communicate a sense of story, a sense of mood. And if you're photographing life, if you're making travel documentary photos, uh, you probably really want those photos to actually look lifelike and realistic. Here's one of the biggest letdowns that you can have if you make those sorts of photos. You put in all the time and all the effort into going after that photo, into actually making it, and it has the potential to be great, but you then ruin it through poor photo editing. Does that not feel super frustrating and like a complete waste of time? Very often, and this seems to especially be the trend these days, you ruin a potentially great photo through photo processing, which is overdone. You know, you edit your photos and they end up looking completely unrealistic. I mean, have you ever cringed at your photos because of the way that you processed them? I know that in a few years, a lot of people will be doing exactly that. And hey, I'm gonna be honest, uh, I've gotta own it. I've re-edited a ton of my own photos because of this very reason, because I processed them in a way which is completely overdone. So 
yeah, with this educational photo resource, I'll help you save time. I'll help you avoid the kind of photo editing, photo processing that'll ruin your photos. And I will help you make the most of your images. Why did I create this now? Well, it's no secret that today, when you talk about travel, most of us are kind of screwed. I'm very lucky that I've been able to travel through much of Peru. That's obviously at this moment, and there are still many limitations, and of course it's wiser to avoid too much contact with people right now. I know that many of you are probably watching this from home or from work, and it doesn't seem like we'll be going very far in the coming couple of months at least. But all of this doesn't mean that we can't keep growing as photographers. I mean, we've got to do something to keep sane during these times. And it does seem now that there really is some light at the end of the tunnel to get us motivated because, you know, quite honestly, with all that uncertainty, no idea when we travel again, it's pretty hard to get motivated. So I'm very glad that things are looking at least a little more positive now. In any case, right now, you're here and you may be one of the people who told me or who told yourself, I'm lacking photo editing, photo processing skills. I still need to improve that. You've been putting off improving them. Too busy, maybe too busy traveling, whatever. Photo processing is incredibly important. It's a huge part of photography. You can't escape it. You still need to learn it. And now may be the quietest, it may be the best time to finally master it once and for all. So that is why I'm launching this educational photo resource right now. Free educational videos. I have mentioned free educational videos at the beginning of this video and as I'm launching this new educational resource, there will be three free videos in the coming weeks. Even if you're not interested in this new educational resource, I'm still releasing them for everybody to watch and to learn. So stay tuned. The first video will be uploaded next week and you can see here exactly what day that'll be. If what I've shared with you up to now sounds interesting, check out the page from where you can buy the light-based Lightroom presets and the photo editing training videos. The link is on the screen and in the description. You'll find much more info there. Very important. The launch price is of course always much cheaper than the regular price and right now you can get the package for $59.97 US dollars. After the launch, it'll be 120 US dollars. You are getting 50% off during the launch. You have until the end of this month or until the new year to take advantage. And uh, that's about all that I wanted to share with you, all that I wanted to say. Thank you very much for watching the entire video. I hope that you check out the next one. I promise it will be very useful. Uh, that's it. Goodbye for now.